So, episode 18, Losing Randy. So if I do one a week, that means it's been about 18 weeks. I don't know how many months that is, but it's a few. Four, four and a half. So, uh, everything's going good. Kind of plateaued on the weight loss. But I haven't gained any, so uh, I got that going for me. But we're, uh, my wife, Rita, has been hitting it hard. She's kicking my ass a little bit on the whole thing. But uh, every Monday, I get back in it. And uh, restart, kind of, if, if the weekend was bad. Whereas in past years, I would have just bailed and just going on a binge so so overall that's good this episode though of losing randy uh we lost randy in las vegas this week maybe it's like finding randy where where is he this time but uh had the international congress of implantology or implantology icoi dental meeting about dental implants in las vegas Got to meet up with some old friends, meet some new ones. Got to watch my buddy Justin Moody, Implant Pathway, shout out. Um, give a speech on, uh, on the big stage. And also he got himself honored at uh, the AAID, American Implant something something. Anyway, honored fellow in the world of dental implants. So congrats out to Justin Moody and Implant Pathway. Uh, Mike Frymouth also got honored there, so so good job to those guys. They're my mentors in this whole dental implant thing. So uh, anytime they do well, hopefully I'll uh, I'll learn a little more from them. And we're gonna see them up later in uh, Phoenix or Scottsdale, I should say, later this month in October um, for some more surgery on um, on veterans, victims of abuse, things like that. Those that can't afford to get the uh, dental care that they want. So uh, maybe we'll get some good surgery videos again. I lost some followers when I started showing surgery, but hey, that's the way it goes. So anyway, I was in Vegas, had a lot of fun. Um, one of the main things that you'll see on this video was that uh, I met Mike Tischler, who is the uh, owner of Teeth Tomorrow. And uh, he's kind of a fun guy. He's, Teeth Tomorrow is a, a chain of dental implant. Uh, kind of like clear choice or whatever. He's got, I don't know, 50 of them. Anyway, he asked me if I wanted to go race exotic cars or drive exotic cars at the exotic car racing or whatever. And I, you know, I really didn't know the guy, but I said, yeah. So, uh, so I went out there with him and he drove a McLaren on this road race or road track. Um, and he said, wow, you should drive a Lamborghini Huracana. So, I drove a Lamborghini Huracana for seven laps. I did push push just under 120 mile an hour, which was pretty damn sweet. So there's some video of that. It's a YouTube that uh, goes with it. Rode in a, a Dodge Hellcat drifting car with a guy that uh, drove in Tokyo Drift. So I don't even remember what his name is. My coach in the Lamborghini was Luigi. Luigi, shout out. Exotic car racing in Vegas, shout out. Um, overall though, went to Vegas, gained two pounds. Wasn't bad, I did a lot of walking. Uh, I don't know if John will put it in there, but at 18,500 steps one day, 19,000, my dogs were barking at the end of the day. And uh, apparently I'm flunking Vegas because uh, I was in bed before midnight every night. But it's always good to get back home bring the things you learn at these classes back, use them in practice, and I used I used one of them the first day I got back. Something I learned out there, very first patient of the week. Um, so, so learning is, is something that I'll, I'll never get tired of. So, uh, what else? I guess that's about it. So, uh, go off to my granddaughter, Sydney has a volleyball match, so we're going to go watch that. She's a junior in high school, so uh, hopefully they'll crush it. And that's all. So, hey, tune in to Losing Randy, and we'll see you uh, next time. Thanks. All right, so I'm standing outside the front door of the Bellagio Hotel in Vegas at a dental conference. Well, we've all never been to Vegas, but 
I'm not much of a gambler. But it's a fun time here. Gone to a few courses. I did blow 20 bucks on a slot machine and I lost, so I'm, I'm a little pissed about that. But uh, today, for fun, I'm gonna go driving and racing some exotic sports cars with uh, Mike Tischler from Teeth Tomorrow. Uh, just a big dental group that uh, does dental implants. So that'll be some fun. Hopefully we get some video of that. So uh, otherwise, we'll just keep showing you a little bit of the beautiful Las Vegas. And hopefully we'll get some uh, video of that. So woohoo, having fun. All right, so we're getting ready to go out racing. Mikey Tischler back there, getting his lid fixed. South Dakota. South Dakota. Santa Cruz. There we go. All right. Is Vegas treating us good so far, though? Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. So we always have you stop here at the beginning. It's going to give your instructor a chance to check the track to make sure it's clear. Also, check for the drifter because you do not want to pull out in front of him. <laughs> there he goes. Oh, there's not much smoke on his tires. All right, guys, when you first pull out on track at the very beginning, try to stay close to the blue paint if you could. Leave space to the right for any cars that might be coming that we didn't see. So now we're approaching turn one. You have your double orange for braking, single green for turning. Brake toward the green, then release the brakes nice and smooth as you steer into your apex. Quickly locate your exit cone, unwind the steering wheel, and accelerate toward it. And that opens up the straightaway to us. Now I've got a feeling you guys can figure out what to do here. Literally, it's pedal to the floor, but keep your eyes up. You should already be scanning ahead to see what turn two looks like. Double orange cones, brake hard, keep it straight. Waiting for the green before you turn. Don't be that guy who goes to the desert. Please keep it on track. There are marks out there. There are marks. From that apex, you're going to unwind the wheel and accelerate toward your next exit cone. And that's also your final exit cone. Going forward, the track will be much tighter. So here's your turn in for turn three. There's your apex. When you exit turn three here, you only want to exit to about the middle. Quickly back to the right to set up for turn four. When you exit turn four, you want to use about three quarters width of the track and bring it back around to the left to set up for turn five. And the red and white paint that you see in these corners, you can put two wheels on it at every corner. It's blue paint that we want you to try to stay off of. Now I'm gonna pick up the pace and do a faster lap. So it's a light break at the orange, turning it green, back on throttle. Here's my apex, aiming for my turn in cone, braking firm, looking right side, ease off to the corner, a little bit of throttle. Now I'm gonna accelerate, unwind the wheel to my exit cone. Now going forward, guys, you're gonna notice I'm gonna start braking really, really late. Don't use me as an example, please break at those orange cones. So keep it straight, braking firm, off the brakes as you steer into your apex, find your exit cone, unwind, and accelerate toward it. You are back to full speed. Repeat the same steps again. You're going to brake hard straight ahead, looking right side, ease off the brakes as you turn, a little bit of throttle, now accelerate from the middle, back across to the right. Turn four here is a light brake, get to your apex, I'm going to move offline a little bit for this McLaren, bring it all the way back to the left side. All of your laps, your instructor will let you know to slow down and exit. They're going to have you pull off track between the blue cones here, and this path will take you around that corner to the left, and then they will show you where to go from here. All right, today we have Randy Boska. Huska. Huska. My name is Luigi. I'm the instructor for this Lamborghini Huracan. Today we're doing seven laps, today, right? Correct. All right. First things first, always look where you want to go. Yep. Four cones you got to watch out for. Braking, turning, apex, and exit. Yep. To balance it in, I'm going to let you know how much brake to apply and how much throttle. 
especially if this car is a wheel wheel drive version. Uh -huh. So be very, very patient with that throttle, okay? Once you clip that apex, unwind the wheel, squeeze that throttle all the way to the exit, okay? And the mirrors are just here for me, so yep. I'm gonna let you know who to pass and who's gonna pass us, okay? I'll do you let have you any know. questions? You make sure I'm looking good. I can't see myself of course. in the mirror. Yeah, of course, man. You always <laughs> look good, bro. Alright, you good? Alright. Go ahead, nice and easy. Forward? Yes. Make a left right here. Keep going, you see that white wall? Yep, Get yep. closer towards it. Do not hit it. Do not hit it though. <laughs> make a left. It's a very expensive front end. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> Alright, it's the stop sign. Yep. I want you to start pumping the brakes, make sure there's pressure. Proceed forward just a little bit so we can see that drifted. Proceed forward, stop by the last blue cone on the right side here. The last blue cone. Right here. One second. There's one car, okay? Yep. Go ahead, nice and easy. Go ahead, upshift for me. You're gonna upshift one more time. Stay on this left side of the track. Aim for that single green cone. That's gonna be your first turning cone, straight yep. ahead. Closer as possible, okay? Right there. Before you turn in, look where you want to go to the right. Now turn in. Apply more throttle, a little bit more. I want your eyes down the straight. Yep. Unwind the wheel. Go ahead and squeeze that throttle all the way. Go. Keep going. Keep going. Upshift. Full throttle. Go. Full throttle. There you go. Upshift. Keep going. Now brakes. Promotions out in case you want to drive more, but I highly suggest that drifting, okay? Yeah, that drifting looks like a good old time. <laughs> like Thanks, you man. said before, no problem. Any questions? No. Alright, good was job. Sweet. That's some sweet stuff. <laughs> like you say, you're going to be waiting here for a while, so yeah, yeah. you might as well do the drift. Make a ride right here. Sorry, she's slow. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be pit. She's going to park over there, so it's going to be pit number. 18. This one right here. This one, this one, this one, this one. This one, this one. This one. The Port Formante goes in. Alright, brake right here. And then once your foot off the brake, I'm going to give you a USB outside, okay? Okay, we're good. Yep. You want more pictures? Holy shit. Was that fun? 
That was a blast. I think I'm going for riding that drifting car, by the way. Oh. Mike, that was a pretty awesome time. I told you you'd be smiling. <laughs> oh, Lord. I'm going to have to go to oral surgeon just to get this damn smile removed. I'm just going to do a little video here first. YouTube's and all. All right, next, I'm going on a drifting ride in this uh, Hellcat. 702 horsepower ought to get us around pretty fast. It won't be nothing like my Dodge Ram or our Jeep, but I think it'll it'll do the trick. This ain't even like working for a job, is it? Not really. <laughs> it's not my car, so it makes it even better. There you go. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Well, I hope you guys have a great week out here. Thanks again for coming out. We appreciate it. That was a blast. No trip to Vegas is complete with a trip down to old uh, Fremont Street, so we're down here. Crazy, crazy world in Fremont Street. I don't think I've ever seen a bigger crowd as this. What is that? You heard Triumph? I've never seen this big a crowd here. that wraps up the weekend in Las Vegas at the Bellagio had a great time learned to got a good dental stuff dental implant stuff saw a lot of cool sights drove a goddamn Lamborghini Huracan and almost hit 120 mile an hour rode in a Hellcat drifting car had a few drinks 
talked to some friends. Good weekend overall. So, uh, as far as the losing Randy stuff, didn't do too bad. Probably could have done better. But, uh, I guess back to it on Monday, right? So, so let's say goodbye to beautiful Lost Vegas. Lost wages, as we always say. Lost Randy, I wish. All right, take care. Catch you on the flip.